There we go. Hello. I did that, that's because this is one of the holiest beers in the land. <laughs> Today we got ourselves for a brew review, <laughs> the delicious Beguile Barrel Aged Imperial Pajamas. Co-founder and head of Beguile Brewing, Kevin Carey, also the president of the board of directors of the Illinois Craft Brewers Guild. After we filmed that dope ass video you guys saw a few weeks ago, he gave us this iconic barrel-aged beer. An absolute hero. First off, is this not the sickest label you've ever seen, by the way? The label is dope. Dude. So gnarly. And they also, I have to comment on the fact that it's 13.5% of heaven. So you guys probably normally drink um, four point <laughs> yeah. I'm actually concerned that the Corey Sprite doesn't really like barrel aged beers. Uh, I survive off of Natty Light. <laughs> so he told us that three ounces three of essential ounces, water beer. Three ounces of barrel aged beer to one can of Keystone Light. <laughs> well, there you go. So that that is maybe, just maybe math. Yeah, give me a little tilt, something. man. Oh, I gotta tilt it. Tilt, Daddy, tilt. Daddy oh. gets the rest. Dude, look at the head you put on mine. It looks so dope. It just looks tasty. Look at that. Mm. Look at that. Mm. Are you gonna top? Okay. Cheers. Cheers. You guys. Meet the president of the guild and have him give you beers. <laughs> That's the life we should all be living. <laughs> Do that mm -hmm. today. Whatever you're doing, start harassing the internet until you find his address. Go that to his house. way that I connect with on Kevin his door, and Danielle. Until he shows up and then tell him that you are owed one beer, compliments of Sean. Ew. Blindfold him, <laughs> shove Monaco and Four Loco down his throat, and then still Ow. bang my tooth super hard like an idiot. I'll I think it. I'm drunk already. <laughs> <laughs> if you came here for the food instead of the beer, it's gonna be tough to be as good as this beer. We got another little like <laughs> yeah, frozen. Food. We don't really know what this is. I'm excited for it. Chicken bacon ranch, family feast, steak and bake. It's a family feast. Um, That's so, what it says on the so side. I didn't make that up. A piece and about a half uh -huh. is 340 calories, 11 grams of fat, 41 grams of carbohydrates, 19 grams of protein. You might have saw... I have a question. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure that that's what the box says, but I'm also looking at that, and it definitely <laughs> depends on your piece and a half, because like, yeah, man. this is like 100% cheese, and this is like 85% meat. Dude, look like how, how the... thick this, like, <laughs> yeah. it's a thick boy, dude. B-O-I-I. -I. It's the family finding story. It's all the shipping. toppings are in the middle. Then the outside is just all, like, yeah. cheese. So chicken breast, cooked crispy bacon, mozzarella, cheddar cheeses, and creamy ranch sauce on the crust. Look at all the ranch on the crust. Oh, what? Are you are you ready for this? I'm ready for it. I mean, I'm as ready as I ever can be. So this is also made in New Boston, Michigan. I'm a Michigan boy, so uh, shout out, I, shout out. Look at this one. It's loaded with stuff, but it's not too, too big. I am. Look at that. This Look at this piece. Whoa. Mine nice. had been resting on some meat that I shall drizzle over top. <laughs> this is the family finest. Nothing's finer than being in your diner. Nothing's finer than being in your diner. I don't like what I wrote. I want to. I'd like to take the picture back. Why? I'm not happy with what I wrote. It's good. I like it. This is the family finest chicken bacon ranch pizza. Cheers. Cheers. Okay. Ready? Oh, that's really good. Fantastic piece of frozen pizza. Oh, man. Wow. Oh, this is super good. Wow. Wow. This is great. Wow. <laughs> good, good food item. Good Way crap. better than I thought it was going to be. You know what? I know it's got ranch on it, but this would be the ultimate pizza to dip in a oh, cup yeah. of ranch. Oh, my it's God. It's thick, and there's so much bread to it, and all those, like, the saltiness from the bacon. But the bread's kind of but, crispy on mine. Mm-hmm. But, man, I want... Oh, that's good ranch. And I want to dip this in ranch. Jet's ranch. And you know what? Really take a close look at this. I thought the bread was that thick, too, but now I'm starting to think... The bread's not that thick. 
I think that's how much cheese and ranch is on there, bro. I think you're right, dude. So that the it's not too thick. That's why the bread is tasting crispy. I thought it was like, oh, this is gonna be impossible to cook. Right. You're right. It's it's still very maintainable. It's not too mm. heavy. Wow, man. Because there's no pizza sauce on it and it's a ranch base, it's like you're eating this is really good. cheesy bread pizza. Yeah, dude. You know? This reminds me of Hungry Howie's three cheeser bread if it was made into pizza. That's a Hungry Howie's reference. Mm. Hungry how he has some of the best crust toppers of all time. Dude, once again, you just got this corner store. It's got this right by your apartment. You can just go get these whenever you damn well please. Dude, this is like blowing my mind how good this is. 30 ounces. I'm gonna make a bold statement. It's almost a two pound pizza, dude. <laughs> That's amazing, right? Super bold statement. You might not like it. You guys might not like it. Uh oh. I like this pizza more than I like Little Caesars Thin Crust Pizza. Well, I can see why you'd say that. You can see that? Yeah. Okay, I thought I, we were about to have to go to Blows. That crust is uh, subtle. I'm a little, I was nervous. I mean, there street. might be My Sixers. adrenaline was going, I was like, bro, I'm about to piss off Sean on an accident here. I like to see like a Sixer crawl through the screen like in the <laughs> ring. <laughs> How dare you? The ring scene. <laughs> This yeah. is the thickness of pizza that I crave. This is what I want. Okay, doing. okay. Not really a thin crust. Right. Certainly not a deep dish. Right. That in-betweener, I love it. I can see that. Last week we had that amazing cauliflower, 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 <laughs> cauliflower. I'm a little, I'm a kid. You're, Mark, we have cauliflower you're, pizza. You're also thrown off by their, I think, genius pun really kind of stuck in your- Cauliflower. Yeah, you're, you're a little thrown off. By that it. was so good, and now we're back to just like clogging our arteries with wheat, and this is great too. It's both, yeah, we've been on a hot streak on Fridays. And this beer, you already know the answer, but because if we don't do it, people get angry. Uh, drum roll, please. Thanks, Eric. Uh, thumbs up or thumbs down if you like this chicken bacon ranch family finest. Fam it's bang a pimp. Oh, oh, what's that? Oh, oh. Obviously. Duh. Wow. What did you expect? I mean, I loved every second of it. That's the best frozen pizza I've ever had. I've never had a frozen pizza that I actually thought this could rival some chain pizza places. I this really is do. the best white pizza I've ever had. Racist! Eaten. As far as white pizzas go, I love white pizzas. Me too, I don't, I think eating this, I'm like, bro, I don't think I get those enough. I think this might be the best frozen white pizza I've ever had, by far. Yeah, dude. This might be the best frozen pizza I've had. Not me, but I, well, well, I respect well, it for that. What's like, um, on the show, do you think? That screaming Sicilian got me. <laughs> wow, dude, wow. A lot of people said screaming Sicilian's really good. This is incredible. Mm -hmm. It really is. Wow. Too much. I know. I know. We're different in that regard. Look, I don't want us to be different. Okay. You just take all the things that mm -hmm. I like and, and, and adopt you, them. Yeah. Yeah. Don't That's, you know how this works? I'll work on that. Kylie, come explain how relationships work to him. You gotta just do what I like. All right? You understand? That is so white male of you. You gotta do what I like. <laughs> this is a fantastic pizza. Also, Bagal Brewing, absolutely crushing it with the BA stout. God, their beers are so good, dude. Yeah, this is incredible. If you didn't see our uh, video with them, or our second oh my Festival gosh. of Barrel Age Beer event video, uh, those are linked below. Watch them both, because they're both Our next food is done for the next brew review, because we filmed yeah. these on the same day. Blew your mind! Tearing the fourth wall down, sure! I'll have a drink out of both of our glasses! Hey, don't touch my glass! What? What do you think your neighbors think?